Okay, this is the 5 inch chuck and adapter plate that I added to get a little more capacity and now I'm switching over to a 6 inch 3 jaw because the center hole just isn't big enough and the jaws don't stick out enough to grasp a 5C collet block. So, um, if we move in closer here you can see the modifications that I had to make in order to get the bolts to pass through this adapter plate into the chuck. This also allows me better access from here which is in the way. The only way to get the original chuck off was with a stubby which takes forever to unscrew. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this chuck off I'll take the adapter plate off. My plan is to make a new adapter plate that mounts to this but overlaps it so I don't lose any more of my uh, cross slide travel. And then this will bolt to the new adapter which will bolt to the new chuck. One of the things I came up with was a way to adapt so we can see this a ball end Allen wrench I cut it cut off the L and stuck it into this socket adapted to 3 8 to go onto an air ratchet now I still have to use a stubby to break loose the Allen bolts and so here we have the stubby Oop, that's the wrong way So, there's that. They're loosened. Of course the compressor never has any air when you need it. Really nice quick work of that. Unfortunately for this, I need to take this off. So it's back to the stubby. And 
These have to be unscrewed in stages because there's so little clearance. There's literally less than an eighth of an inch between the wrench and this housing at this point. So I can do a partial turn. You see this has the holes for a three jaw and a four jaw mounting. <clears throat> so I had to make relief grinds on the spindle here for all of those holes. And I know some of you are going to say, oh, you butchered your spindle, but say la vie. Now, I know some people have switched over to studs on their chucks or backing plates to go through the spindle, but uh, I only recently noticed that on a couple of YouTube videos. And I may go ahead and acquire a set of studs and nuts to fit this for future. Like the next time I take this thing off like this. But hopefully I won't have to ever do this again.
done that reverse this Anybody with eggs want to have a go with eggs? I'm going to go with And then, of course, when everything else is done, then I have to reverse this process. Which, by the end of the day, you just want to, once you're done doing this, you just want to go drink. Now you get a clearer picture of how badly I butchered the spindle. But, hey, I own it. I can do whatever I want. Huh. Now we move on to the next phase. <laughs> 